Hi guys, Dane here, and welcome to another weekly reading vlog. Uh, I'm currently reading The Early Asimov, Volume 3, by Isaac Asimov. It's rather good so far. I'm about two thirds of the way through. I'm just about to start reading a, a story called The Red Queen's Race. My only issue with it so far would be that the last, but uh, the last uh, piece in this, it was like fictional non-fiction, so it was written in the form of like an academic research paper. So I had a lot of trouble focusing on like what exactly is going on, you know. But yeah, I am enjoying it so far. A full review will be coming soon, so keep your eyes peeled for that. And uh, yeah, I'm off to go and do some work and stuff. Hello, it is me. Hopefully I'm in shot. I have some news for you. My Canon G7X, here we go. I had a Canon G7X Mark II and this happened to it. Um, basically the way this one worked, I used to have a Mark I and the Mark II had a little arm that it extended on. This little arm thing. And I just think it's very poorly designed, especially for what's ostensibly like a vlogging camera. So because it came out on this hook, this thing, this thing weakened, this thing fell off, and then that basically yanked the screen off. So now I'm selling this for spares and repairs. So now we're filming on my Canon G9X, which I, I accidentally bought this camera because uh, I was buying a bunch of them. Um, I was flipping them on eBay basically, so I was buying them cheap and then selling them high, and I accidentally bought a G9X. The reason I'm telling you all of this is that it doesn't have a viewfinder, so I'm doing my best to frame my shots before I start and hoping for the best. It is vlog time. It is currently Thursday, the 10th of December. Uh, Susie came over yesterday, so she did some more editing on our Stoics video, which is very cool. Very excited to get that out. Um, also, been learning a few bits. Like I've been, we've been switching to Final Cut Pro, uh, and as you can see, the background and stuff. I'm trying to shake things up a bit, make things a little bit more visually appealing and um, stuff like that. So. Uh, but it's just difficult at times. I've got Biggie down here. Can I pick you up? Yeah. So yes, yeah, Susie was over yesterday, wasn't she, Biggie? And uh, she came and was doing... Ow! Ow! Was doing some... Ow! Get off, you bad cat. He's attacking me. <laughs> so yeah, anyway... Uh-oh, he's looking at my leg. I'm scared. So... Ooh! So Susie came over. So anyway, that was what we did yesterday. I made some food, uh, got up early today, and I've just been being productive, as you do, and I'm still attempting to do that. I've finished reading The Mysterious Mr. Quinn by Agatha Christie. I would probably give this like a 3.5 out of 5. It was okay. It was very different to Christie's other stuff, but hey-ho, it was uh, cool to get something a bit different. And this now means I've officially finished reading all of Agatha Christie's books, although my next plan is to read the books that she wrote under a pseudonym, Mary Westmacott, which are like romancy books. So I'm not particularly looking forward to getting to those, but I am a completionist. And I know my uncle, my uncle Carl, has read all of the Christie novels, but he hasn't read all, any of the Westmacotts actually. And I've read one, I've read The Rose and the Yew Tree, and it was actually all right. So um, yeah, those are next. I'm currently reading Creative Mischief by Dave Trott. This is non-fiction. Uh, I want to read this actually right at the start. Um, because I love this story from Creative Mischief. When I worked at BMP, the head of television commuted in from Brighton every day. He started reading The Exorcist on the train. He said he thought it was the most evil book he'd ever read. In fact, he said it was so evil he couldn't finish it. So at the weekend, he went to the end of Brighton Pier and threw it as far as he could. So I went to the bookshop. I bought another copy. Then I ran under the tap and left it in his desk drawer for him to find. As Dawn French says, if it's funny, it's not bad taste. And if it's bad taste, it's not funny. So yeah, I'm enjoying that so far. A dedicated review of that coming soon. Just gonna be hard at work today. I've gotta go and meet an artist at 6 p.m. to go and get some paintings over at the art center. Uh, other than that, I plan to do a lot of recording and stuff today uh, and see how far I get with that. All right, it is Saturday the what, 12th of December. I'm just coming up to the end of William Shakespeare's Star Wars now, so I should finish that soon. Not 100% sure if I'm in shot. It's hard to tell with this camera. It looks like I'd be more in shot if I did this. I've got a bunch of t-shirts down here, all different sizes and designs because of the uh, Wickham Art Centre campaign we run. Uh, I, this is one of them, so it's very cool. I've got a whole bunch of these limited edition ones. I've somehow managed to get food stains on this one already. Typical, the only white one. Yeah. Um, 
Just been reading some more Shakespeare. Uh, the gig I have this evening is coming up, so I've just been printing off guitar tabs, trying to relearn guitar solos and all this stuff. I uh, haven't really practiced at all for this one, so we'll see how it goes. But it should be fun at least. And I have to go to the art center later because uh, someone's setting up some like Christmas lights. So I'm gonna take my laptop and do a few bits of work while I'm there. And um, I'm just being as productive as I can. Um, and then Susie's coming over later to do some editing. She's probably gonna come here before the gig. And then we'll go to the gig together. I'm so worn out and tired and I slept. Okay, but I woke up still feeling exhausted, which doesn't seem like there's any justice. Um, I don't think I got any books today, though. Did, oh, no, I did. I got a book in the post. So I have to haul this in a minute. But this is uh, La Hobbit by J.R.R. Tolkien. Uh, Bilbo La Hobbit, I think. I, I Basically, I ordered some other French children's books. And this arrived instead. So um, I've had to message them being like, I think you sent me the wrong book, but can I keep it, please? because um, that'd be good all right okay so it is Sunday Sunday the 13th of December uh, I finished reading William Shakespeare's The Jedi Doth Return I will be doing a review of this shortly enjoyed it probably a four out of five uh, it's just Ian Dersh does a great job writing these and I'll probably be reading some more of his stuff I think he's also done one does it say on here what his other, what, what his other books are? he's done the rest of the Star Wars series but I think he's also done, um, he's done at least one that was just some random movie that I wanted to read as well. Uh, anyway, oh, it was Mean Girls, I think. Um, so yeah, I did enjoy it, four out of five stars. Uh, and now I'm currently reading It Came From Ohio, My Life as a Writer by R.L. Stein. Probably another four out of five stars for me. Enjoying this one quite a lot. Um, he's, I'm at the point at the moment, uh, about two thirds of the way through, he's just started writing Goosebumps. I didn't realize actually Fear Street came before that. But it was cool to read like his earlier life. He worked as an editor for a bit. Um, he was like involved in his school paper and all this stuff. So uh, very much recommend. As for life stuff, um, I don't know when I last updated you guys. I know on Friday we went to Wagamama for dinner. Saturday I had to do some stuff at the art center. Um, and then, uh, then Susie came over and I made Beyond Burgers. She's been editing the video for uh, our Mad Lord Literature and Madam Media channel, which should now be out, uh, our video on Stoicism. So I will link to that below. And uh, yeah, she came over and was editing that. I made us these Beyond Burgers. Then we went out to the Phoenix where I played a gig as part of my band, The Ilk. So I will cut some footage at the end of this vlog. Um, then Sunday, today, um, finished off editing that video, kind of a lazy morning really, it's raining outside so it's one of those nice, you know, lazy days when you just chill at home I guess. Um, and I had, uh, we exported the Stoic video, it's 30 minutes long and because my inter internet sucks, I took it to the art centre and uploaded it from there and then we were missing like 6 minutes of it. So uh, now I'm re-exporting it and then I'll go back to the art centre again later and hopefully, because uh, Susie wants to share it before she goes to bed. So hopefully get it done within the next couple of hours or so. But that's where we're at, so I'm going to love you and leave you for this week's vlog. As always, thanks a lot for watching. Don't forget to let me know in the comments if you've read any of these books and if so, what you thought of them. Hit that like button if you've enjoyed the video. Hit that subscribe button for more and I'll see you soon for another bookish video. Enjoy this footage of my band playing some songs. You ask for it, you get it. Oh, oh no, that's no, no,
Be my master, 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 be my master